e bi fawru si ari nabi bali jo mada ti jo den sidu ari den ko andu attata the corruption of yai jamme in this past 22 years was a brutality in this country so we seen what corruption could do to a state and under developed state with corruption will never ever develop and human rights will never be observed in that country the whole country was victimized people were killed people were disappeared people were shot from their own place they push people and touch at people's mind that nobody would work on his own everyone was working to please him he is a dictator because he dictates everything he dictates everything the man was everywhere the man was controlling him everywhere i attended uh, the very school i am sitting right now and this was my classroom at that moment two of our colleagues students their rights has been violated by our own security forces here was where i received the information that you know we are going to go for a, a demonstration i'm yusuf ambai one of the survivor of april 10 and 11 year 2000 I was at school on that day going to school by not knowing that there will be a student protest on that day what I could see was students shouting running guns and bullets firing up so I tried to run away running 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 for our life for think students were killed on that very day and I was shot in that protest at this very very place where I'm standing on my way running I I was shot on the middle of the road here. I wake up and I find myself being hospitalized. I ask what am I doing here? They and they told me that you have been shot just near my spinal cord. They take me to Nineville Scotland Nineville Hospital. My treatment was incomplete because the security service whenever they get accident or anything happen to them, they used to go to that other hospital and they didn't pay their bills. So it's a grand crop sir because the government was having all the money to facilitate our treatment. because the money was here the big man was enjoying the money who is the big man <laughs> yeah yeah jam who is here jam <laughs> yeah the former government president how did you rate him what kind of leader was he <laughs> no he is everything and if i over more than the word bad there was this one great marabo who is called serindigal President Yayajame feared the crowd that was behind Serindigal. In 2007, he passed away. Between 2007 and 2009, his elder son was the one who was in the village in charge of affairs. With full force, an executive order was given according to them. This executive order was what brought the parliamentary in. Ngab jass da xar bunti ni, da xar bunti ni, da ko gor. Ni du ko da jatt, da jël yefi nit, fasu nit, xaram nit. bay nit nagu nit dor nañu fi ci bir dekk bi fiñ dekk lañu ñaka doore doori metti ndax ko ñi jappu dañ la dor ba doto man dara ñu tërel la ci pikop bi dor la jëmale makati ba paré pikop bi dañ lay téglanté juroom nit juroom ben amul ki tëddé ci kaw ki dañ la dor ba sayram bi fu nekk di gëna dret dañ ma jappu di ma dor samay samay yi ni yëpp dafa mujjon ni di ma jappu di ma dor sama papa mom mo ron alkali fi ni ki ni don wax ak yeen sama rakki papa la won sama papa bol kerak ba paray ñi bañ ko ndañé fétal gi ci yalla dem ba ñami dem dalé ba légui borom bi mom nako laqu na légui ni wa moy né manam légui dañ ma not niñ mo noté moy ci su kaw suma diina bi mu doon dundu ci lañ mo noté génn ma sama rew man ak sama jabot tek nak sama ben domu jigen bo xamne mo ngi warono toll ci 5 years mo ngi taxaw mo wadam dañ go door tek mo ngi takkon jeli yu melni comme jeli jeli yi sama gannaaw ñu tek ko daati koy nangu ci mom daati jeli ya yaayam yaayam ngi ti ci kër bi mo dal li ci nguru yaay jamme mo waral li mo mo waral li baat yi yi sukk diko dako def nak tax ñi am doole ji nga xet tom pom dako ngeup ci ni xeri ni dako doon ci bakkan jamono bobu nak fek na manam legi gambi mom fofu manam tuñ fa dund legi nak manam ci la nguru gambi gi ebal parent yi ak manam legi sen arme ñi ñew dal ci kawam manam nit ñi nek fi ñi joge fan ak ñew senegal fi bi ñewé nak man dama bokkon ci ñi nga xamné dama len dalalon ndax ñi bañ fay joge 
amul kenn ko xamne am nga dara lo xamne ni dafa melni ku lakale rek amul dara lo genn sa kër bis bob dundu nañ fi dundu bo xamne ni xayna comme nima waxone ci suba gi rek manam ben nit bo xamne man nga ku teunk amut ndax manam legi bus junni journaliste gambi ñewon fi sax manam legi pour laaj lool manu ñom manam fexe ba jël affaire bobu yeb bam jeex ci alal soxon nañ ñuko nañ ñuko delo ñi dem dekkat comme ñi dekkat ci ci alal mom mo du da sun live comme ñu ko do wa joxe do da mo dey waxan ñu atakat bi atelier ci high court lañ ko atté wala fan lañ ko atté ñu ñaaté ci ay court sibu magbi waaw gambi gambi Freedom to return to their homes, gather in worship, and maintain their beliefs without discrimination. That's the groundbreaking High Court ruling ending 11 years of state sanction restrictions for followers of late Upper Salem scholar Sheikh Muhammad Habib Seka, widely called Nigel. We are a small pastoral community devoted to the ways and teachings of our spiritual leader. whose legacy was almost destroyed Kermud Ali resident and compound owner Yunusa Sisi told GRTS and recounted how their homes were forcibly taken and their beliefs outlawed by police under the Jammu administration delivering a marathon judgment at the high court justice Aminata Sahwa Sisi underscored that free will and individual liberties are guaranteed by the Gambian constitution whilst outlining an eight point injunction that orders home owners from the village to return home and further restrains the attorney general from preventing them from accessing their homes court be dañ wax ne ñew win ñu jox ñu suñ kay ne yo ñew win way ba tay manu ñu dem fole government instead of anything have sent some paramilitary officers to be stationed and protect the illegal occupants of our properties now that is gross injustice rather than them giving us our properties and protecting us they are now protecting the 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 the, the unlawful occupants who are occupying our properties kon nak mo wax ci xibaaru gambi luma xam la ci luma sawar la luma war la itam suma ko defé luma war la ndax bis bi ma taxaw man li la don xaar bis bi tay ignore_time_segment_in_scoring Ado lep ta ano nyi nenga musu kodo maso da suutu wala ntel la jang, no so kili nebi jang, nenga ana to no so nyi ya, asa fo bor ta bulu, ato hani musu kodo ma nyi nju bi na, minen tundu sare bojo do minen jah ko yata bulu jo chapan ta tinet do do hender tundu he, si koko do min goni kodo woni lopitan ame no, e hai he hel polisi o ko hali ko, e wonde mane tundu ti ongari ha on kebi o hapu yimbe on di pota wale de lopitan, minen tundu sare bojo ha hande min kebani lopitan, min ko ama dum balon bi temi sare bojo, e bledge hel woka, ko min woni no sare o do. hande hande do sare bojo do bot onon fof mi sikki haydal wi gol do inde amin ko mi amadou mbalo hen der sare bojo ko mi nos di hersini kam saleb gol do aduna fof di yiya kam because ko hodum sabi dum so on ji structure do gommi do do jodi mi do hen der office amo o watto do do l'hopital yel am do dum woni dispensary dal so on darti nima sudu do ha min do jodi mi do he structure on der on wa ini han dum di hulbini di hersini di hawni sato wati do talam pula suto wado talam saba suto wado talam nan ko moto ma moto soto ngata sare tiyo lenoma nga musuko no mañi bulande wado nimbitala musuko no mañi ase wulum bulu siloka wado ase bata sare bojo ala lopita lopitan ala do o lopitan larton do o he o tele o lopitan koy lamu jawara mo fewna te si andari an do do dari mi do koy serandi am dari mi lawol hakkundo e sare man so sa hebi do debore do dum ko probleme den sare bojo janna bata da warta bake biri persida ya jamela wato Tella ja ya ja mena tala ja ay mitino ken na ni soto koto ja aka be ma koy la silo la be ma koy ra kurang na te minen gil ya ya ja mela mi minen ala ko min kebe to sengo ma sakunda min dogi ha mi ngodi hay dara min keba ne sengo ma sakunda saboni te andari e tundu sare bojo ko min jobata tan helempo te andari tundu sare bojo business pare sare bojo do ko natinta hender lamu e ta sare bojo ala la wol mojol ala lopitan mojo e minen dum na jatili minen ko hodu woni dalila lamu ngu wadi minen ni Eh te wana wonde ma min topitaaki ko lamu ngowi ko min di joba lempo min di mbada ko kala bi amen jangi siko ko be mbada nani minen ko foti wadde ko jada ken le abunda mol be latti la to loptano la ala yak alna la kila ala mol de ma loptano bata min be mol ka kala so bata bon di mol ka ka to mol bata ta sara bo jeddi mbal bele bata ta
My name is Al Haji Ellis Sonko. I started working for the Gambian judiciary in 1990. I was unlawfully dismissed in 2009. This was after a letter was written to the office of the president that we, the staff out at the Sheriff's Division, misappropriated $9 million. When the investigation was mounted, it was discovered that the story was not true because of the entire amount that was involved. All the monies were lying at the accounts office. When the superintendent investigated the matter and discovered the story to be untrue, he called in the then chief justice and the then sheriff who wrote to the office of the president and obtained statements from them in readiness for charging them for giving false information to the office of the president. And because of that, the thing uh, was aggravated because it was either them or us. I was being accused of misappropriating about 2.5 million because what they did was me and the five other accused persons, they shared the $9 million between us. And then I was uh, remanded into prison custody. Economic crimes was added onto the charges so that we, the matter should, can be transferred to the High Court. We went to court for about two years during which all the witnesses spoke, gave their evidence, but none of them named me. One day, at around 11.35 p.m. at night, when I got a text message from my lawyer to the effect that the case is withdrawn. The pensioners' uh, uh, problem with social security emanates from the erosion of the institutional strength of social security. Social security over the years has been weakened to a level that the president actually does whatever he wants with the institution. And uh, therefore, the capacity to deliver the service that they're supposed to deliver to the contributors of their funds was uh, catastrophically reduced. Man, I'm a senior, 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 Jaffe Jaffe Binja Amwene, then they have every three years increment bomb, then you call it from UK, Munyo Portinum, Nyuko Nyuko Dimbale. So receive Nyko Nyarion, but the third time, Bimnue, why you told you Amuko, Jamir of Kujin, yeah, Jamir of Kujin. He takes them out according to what he wants and do with the funds as he wishes. But you know, at the time, whatever prevails, prevails. The institutions are. None of them. I don't think any of them were working. We work. They don't like social security. So the pensioners and uh, contributors of the funds of the social security, have, they don't even know. So they, have, they, they don't even know. And the people who are supposed to represent them are not even there. When this new government of His Excellency President Adam Abaro came into office, there was an announcement to the effect that all people who were unlawfully dismissed with presidential intervention should take their matters to the office of the personnel management office, which I did with my other colleagues because we were a 16 number. I discovered that they were all paid their monies. Those who want to come back to the job were reinstated and given their positions back and paid for all the period they sat down and they started working. One of my co accused is a current High Court judge, one is a magistrate at the High Court, another one, the then Judiciary Secretary is now working in the office of the Chief Justice. It is only me, Sonko, who is left in the Lord. I was dismissed, and that bars me from holding any elective office in the Gambia, and it bars me too from getting back into the public service. And that's terrible. It means me, I cannot stand for any elective office in this country. And if I have any ambition, it means I have to sell it. They got reinstated, got their monies to aid it, and they are working and being paid a salary. And I've been sitting down at home for the past, in October, it shall be 10 years, and I'm the father of six. With my wife, my children, we are living here in SL, in total penury, suffering, immutably, and without end, and without change. Where is justice? Where is justice going? Who murdered, who murdered justice? Because if justice exists, this, cannot, this should not happen. Then came another. Farango, Congo, when you go to Amen, Farango, when you go to Amen, Farango, Boni, 
sabum ko gol min ligoto no min keba ko min guri hada nayi hada horti hada daso awawa jodo sabu ala do burda sona kande ma hada woni babo sawabi ayahat biddo ma o gara tegata mo ko to do ware to sabu sona dum o yoro to kaba pur halumita dum fo ko yidde ko wuri min gura besguli amen ko dum wanni min dum wadi jamanu minen min meda fongda ko min choda saaku maaro ta min ganda ko saaku maaro jarata faro amen go min ligoto non go on jamanu ta go yakaaki ko jaji hande non faro go boni min gala lawol ndiyam dam yakki faro go jakke de jakki faro go min jidi wallede min keba lawol yaaya jamme anno chef amen o wulliti mo wonde no mi de jidi ligani lawol amen faro go o jambitinani bo go do jambitani mo do wi bo e yi min mi do to jidi faro to wi bo e sa ari tan na hebat mi de jinno ligani lawol persi dan ya jamme mi okki go do temedere pantati etar yo lig o lig min lawol be ngari be gaddi taratoji be nabi leydi be nabi kaaje jonte didi jonte tati be bi be jaha be gadda ligotobe ha hande ko dum hendu du yadata ye ha boy min je ko corruption gondo e lamo e ko dum takata ha lawol gol yahani project bati ndi do do war 2014 2015 project nemo be gari be puddi do be jahan do ko buri 10 km sa be dari my name is mamudu cham uh, i'm a born citizen of the gambia and a born citizen of my own village chairman taking about the corruption on the educational side as a professional teacher i have little, little thing to say about the corruption of the 22 years of yaja mesidin in this country he would send out you know officials to go around the school and see whether the money is executed on party issue or or whatever we are never mandated to use the money to build classes we are never mandated to use the money to you know buy books or whatever so now looking at it where you have a student a grade 9 student who cannot read a letter you look at a grade 12 student who cannot read a letter and before his regime we have some people at form 1 2 who were able to read very well and that's why we have this mass movement of people outside the country because you graduate from a senior secondary school you have you don't have any good results so what are you going to do in the country min gari gaynum pour terta dembo dari wadi dari be ton be bimbo mi yakki leydi ndi farongo mi ligaki go mi hadi go yimbe te minen do chamen do minen do jogino groupe aji di ganduda waktu fo waktu be demo yanan no minen ulamu ya jamme ko chadele te o immoto no o ya faraji mako kanilla ko baydolo be liganto mo asu sa wasiya sa wiya maka jaho asu sa wasiya o ba jaha te sa ayi liga gol gol ala fofta golde si wona ajipo soldaro be nande wiema para be nande wiema ko ali goto do tana fofto tako demira nan no mbo ko ha nyaani ja heba bamtare kono den bamtare heba ke e nyaani ja mabbe remo yanno be be beedi tar onno dinon e naaye kanyume governor o wi joni jehe mbado e be ares ko dalilu hombo taki hombo hada yimbe be farongo te makko o yaha o ligaki farongo be ngari be gaddi taratoji be nabi leydi be nabi kaaje jonte didi jonte tati be bi be jaha be gadda ligotobe we are we should be in the class to learn he took us out in the class lessons and go and stand on the highway or go and walk onto his farm everybody was run away to work for yajame but not work for the country this is the problem this is the problem the government was brought in because of the plight of the victims but the government seems to have forgotten about the victims of yajame and it was because of victimization and the suffering gambians went to on the yajame that everybody decided people decided to vote him out of office and bring in somebody who take care of us when it comes to the new gambia i'm not seeing any changes i see the only one changes and is a former president and apart from that no nothing has been changed because things are still the same corruption was the reason why those people are illegally occupying their, our, our properties as at now and it is that same corruption which we believe is still keeping them in that place and in the present regime now we don't think that corruption should have a real space in this new regime if we want to move forward so we are calling on him to do the proper reform which we need security sector reform judiciary reform 
civil society everywhere so that the, the nation should be transformed. We are looking for a better Gambia. A better Gambia after him. <laughs>